Will you be able to afford the average cost of retirement? Charles Schwab Retirement Plan Services recently conducted a 401k participants and found that Americans, on average, believe they'll need $1.7 million to retire. It may sound high, Schwab's estimate was based on what survey respondents thought they would need for retirement, and they're not too far off the mark. The average house, that's not the $1.7 million Schwab's respondents estimated, but we're not finished yet because we must consider rising life expectancy. The social security, but you don't have to cover all these costs on your own. Social security, but if we subtract about $400,000 from our estimated retirement expenses calculated above, we end up with a range between $1.5 million and $2.1 million, which is in line with what Schwab survey respondents expect they will need. These estimates can serve as a baseline, but if you want a truly accurate estimate of what you'll need for retirement, you have to create a personalized plan. You can follow this, first, estimate the length of your retirement by subtracting your planned retirement age from your estimated life expectancy. Next, tot ITLL also ask for your estimated investment rate of return. Use 5% Try to contribute at least as much as your plan recommends to retirement savings each month. If you can't, even the best retirement estimates probably won't hit the nail on the head, but having some kind of plan is essential to saving enough for a comfortable retirement, A. Eh? The Motley Fool has A. Eh? Sponsored the $16,728 Social Security bonus most retirees completely overlook. If you're like most Americans, you're a few years or more behind on your retirement savings. But a handful of li-